Hi, you're watching AssemblyCode.com. I'm so sorry. I have I just have been having a lot of homework over these weeks. But for some weird reason, I haven't gotten spelling homework yet. But our teacher does say that he's always tired because he has to stay for teacher meetings. But been doing that to make sure that he's a good teacher. So so they so yeah. But anyhow, our teacher is Joey Lincoln. Yeah, if, you if you know him, sorry for using your name if you don't want me to. But anyhow, his name is Joey Lankoma, and he's a sixth grade teacher at um, uh, Iowa Community School District School, and he is the adult, and he is very, very nice. And um, I think he's been one of the best teachers I've ever had for some reason. I don't know why, it's just I really wanted Miss Saunders, then I got Mr. Lankoma, then I'm like, <coughs> for some reason I feel more relaxed with a boy teacher. I don't know why. But I do. Well, at least that's a good thing. How do you guys like your teachers? Are your teachers good? That's pretty cool. Subscribe down below if your teachers well, are good. No, but anyhow, but can you please subscribe to this video? It's not over there yet. Okay. So anyhow, <clears throat> if you haven't noticed or you have noticed yet, <clears throat> I'm wearing my Broncos mascot necklace. Ta-da! And um, <clears throat> excuse me, I. I believe, no, I don't believe. I know that they won. They won a game, like, I think Saturday or Sunday, but I knew they won a recent game, so that's going to be up on the roof. And um, here's um, something about Taylor Swift. Um, so with Taylor Swift, you know, like, you guys probably think all of her songs are breakup songs, right? I'm not saying all of you guys think her breakup songs. I personally, myself, am a huge Taylor Swift fan. I'm not the biggest one. There are way people that are, you know, have way more things than me. But um, I, I like her as a singer, and I think her songs are very awesome. And I would never want to let her down. But anyhow, um, so. I'm assuming most of you, may, everybody has to hear Taylor Swift because she's like number one breakup songs for you guys, right? Well, to me, she's like the number one person who everybody has to know. I don't care if you know any of her breakup songs or not, I, you just have to know her. But um, anyhow, she is from Nashville, Tennessee, I believe. And um, anyhow, mm -hmm. I'm not giving you personal information because I don't have any. But anyhow, um... What is it? Okay, so to me, I think you guys just know her breakup songs like we are she never lives. ever getting back together yes. and all that. Like mean and stuff from her Speak Now album. Anyhow, we are never ever getting back together is from her red album and it's number six on her album. Oh yeah, and um if you guys haven't done so yet, you guys like if you guys really like Taylor Swift and you guys don't know about this she has a red album that just has the regular standard 16 songs, like a regular CD. But then she has the same red album, but it's real big letters. Here, wait two seconds and I'll go get it. So keep them entertained. Okay. Set and hurry up. I'm here. Okay. Wait, guys, I gotta get these in order for you. Anyhow, um, so this is my collection of Taylor Swift. All right, I know I'm kind of hey, Taylor Swift's Fearless album. First. First. No, first. her Taylor Girl album was first. This is yeah. her beautiful Fearless album. It involves that song, that song, Love Story and Hey Steven, White Horse and You Belong With Me, Breath and Breath. Tell Me Why, and um, You're Not Sorry. And all of her other songs, which they are really cool, and that's a cool picture. Then I think this is pretty much an awesome picture of her. Fearless, everybody. Okay. 
Then we have her Speak Now album. This is really awesome. I really like this album particularly because, um, well, actually, here's a cleaner version of the Speak Now one. It's not clean. There's no bad ones in any of her albums whatsoever. I'm just saying, like, because the front covers, like, has a lot of scribbly lines. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. But here's um her Speak Now Target. Except for, um, this is her Taylor Swift, um, that Big Machine Records, like Target.com yeah. one, and it's the exact She same. says one bad word, stupid. That's not a bad word. Stupid old pickup joke. Is stupid a bad word, you guys? I don't think so. You're all probably at least thir in third grade or up, so that's not a bad word. I hope so. It's if not I bad see you guys, me. I'm very sorry for swearing. I'm very sorry, but it's, uh, to me, it's not. Right? Not My to dad me. says it's not a bad word either. But anyhow. First grader. Not kindergarten. <laughs> okay, but um, here's her mind song from her. Remember, this is Taylor Swift. Right there, Taylor Swift Speak Now album. This is her mind song. Plus, she has Sparks Fly. I'll show them all of them. And then I have this song stuck in my head. I really like it. It's called Back to December. Sorry, Back, Back to, to December. December. And um, it's really cool. But at first, when I was little, I didn't know this was Taylor Swift. I didn't even know she existed. Like, I saw girls with this shirt, and at first I thought it was Hannah Montana, because I used to like Hannah Montana now. But, you know, she's kind of, my size has kind of gotten, no offense to you guys, but I don't really like her. But, anyhow, we came here to talk about Taylor Swift. Okay, but, um, yeah, this is her Back to December song, and I'm sorry for making this so long. You guys probably have to get to school. I have to get to school in, like, five minutes, so I'm going to rush this. Okay. This is her Speak Now song, and it is about a wedding, and this guy, if you see the guy on the white with, uh, that is the guy who's marrying um, this particular girl. And then Taylor Swift walks in, and I picture it as she, there's a wedding, right? And then the magical moment happens, and then this, I don't know what happens, but then... Something happened because they, I don't think he said he wanted to marry her. So, I don't know. I, I This is just a song, guys. I don't know. a story. But she won an award last, no. In 2012, the night of the Grammy, sorry, the night of the Grammy Awards, Grammy Awards, she won the, the song, she won the, she um won because that's, no, uh, this else um, is her best song, it seems like, and it's no, her uh, main song. She's she made wins. it. It's really cool. And then that, I gotta go to rush it, guys. And then Be Better Than Revenge, and then Haunted, excuse me, and then Long Live, and yeah, Last Kiss. Okay, so then here's the same thing. And then here is her red album. This is the one I'm talking about. See, this is the back of her red album. This red album right here, this one has the 16 songs plus the additional first recordings of it. Um, and this first one is, this first song, well, it's not a song, but this is a prologue. And um, it's kind of the introducing of it. Then this one is the State of Grace. This is her first song that she made on this album, Red. State of Grace. Red, of course. And then Treacherous. And I Knew You Were Trouble. And um, All Too Well. And 22, if you guys know that. I don't know about you. Mom, thank you, 22. Okay, but... um. This song is I I Almost Do, and then this one is the one I love. We are never ever getting back together like ever. And, excuse me, and um, we are never, this ever, one is ever. Stay, Stay, Stay. If you guys know that song, it's a, a good song. Stay, it's like, stay, stay. kind of like that John, Johnny Appleseed, if that's, uh, if that's not a guy, but it's like, it's the beginning of the tune, it's like, da, 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 da. but um, this is the last time, right? Yeah, the last time I've heard this song, it's really nice. 
and then this one's holy ground, and then this one's sad, beautiful, tragic, and um, then she has the lucky one about the girl, about this girl who um, disappeared for some reason, and they told legend about it, and, the, and then everything has changed, which was featuring Ed Sheeran, and you can watch that music video on um, Vivo or YouTube or whatever. Vivo. And then this one's Starlight. And this is also the song that for Taylor Swift's new perfume called Taylor. Um, she was dancing to this song on the beach with sparklers. It's really cool. Seems all fairy taleous, fairy taley. And then this one's excuse me. And this one's Back to December. This is her last song in her red Taylor Swift album. Back to December. It's a very good song. And here's her last picture of it. Sorry for like going in. Okay. But then this is all of her albums. They're really awesome, guys. If I were you, I would. This is only if you guys like Taylor Swift. If I were you guys who love Taylor Swift, I would like get this album if I could. They're only like five to ten. No, no, I didn't like that. But um, I have to go now. So thank you so much, you guys, and have a great day at school today. And yeah, goodbye. Ta da!